Hi, I'm Lee from the iPod Clinic. We are repair specialists for iPods, iPhones and other gadgets. And I'm going to be giving you some tips and tricks for your iPods and iPhones. Okay, so in this video, we're going to show you how to unfreeze your iPod. Um, if you've got an iPod Touch, you can unfreeze it by holding the power button and the center home button down for around five seconds. Hold these buttons down until you see the Apple logo again and your iPod will start to boot up again. Um, that could take a little while. If you have an iPod Classic or any iPod with a, a center click wheel, you can also reset this, but by using the um, menu and center buttons together, again for around five seconds, as soon as you start to see the Apple logo, it will start to boot up as with the iPod Touch. If resetting your iPod doesn't work, then you can try plugging it into the mains. It may be really low on battery, which means that uh, it doesn't have enough power to run it properly or start up. Uh, you can try plugging it into iTunes to see if it responds to that. Um, with the iPod Touches, if you've downloaded any apps uh, recently, uh, they may be the culprit if it's freezing a lot more often than it used to do. So this sits in memory with the iPod and it sits open for a while. What you can do is uh, unlock the iPod, double tap the center home button. You'll see all the apps that are currently in memory. If you hold onto one of those, they'll start to wobble and you'll see some minus signs. If you tap the minus signs, you'll remove the apps from memory. They're still on the iPod, but they won't be running, which means that you may start to see the iPod become more stable and stop freezing. So that's how to fix uh, a frozen iPod or try to fix a frozen iPod. Um, if that doesn't work, you, you may have to send it into a repair specialist, but generally most problems are repairable. <laughs>